It means that we're going to have to work a lot harder in terms of our training. Uh, we're going to have to perhaps find uh, new techniques uh, uh, to deal with these situations. Uh, you must always remember, though, uh, we have human beings uh, that are involved in these. Our police officers are human beings. They make judgments. They make judgments under tremendous stress. And uh, the officers made judgments in this case, uh, uh, which uh, led to the death of Eula May Lowe. Pursues, and actively pursues, ways to avoid this kind of And uh, has rendered his, uh, his judgment in the matter. Uh, as you know, we completed our investigation uh, over a month ago, and uh, in the period of time since that investigation was completed and, uh, and today, uh, our people have been reviewing that investigation. It has been submitted to our shooting review board uh, for a judgment to be rendered there. It then goes to an assistant chief. The assistant chief reviews uh, the decision of the shooting review board that decision ultimately comes to me. Now, the decision of the Shooting Review Board was that the shooting uh, was in policy. Uh, there was one uh, uh, individual who indicated it was in policy but not up to standards, but the majority vote uh, was that it was in policy. The Assistant Chief uh, reviewed that. He agreed with that decision. Uh, and after a very extensive review by myself uh, uh, and with the Assistant Chief, uh, I agree with that decision. Uh, so the shooting will be classified as in policy. Uh, with that, uh, I think uh, we can perhaps uh, open it up to uh, your questions. Chief, Mr. Vandekamp said there were some tactical and strategic questions raised about the way the incident was handled. Well, certainly uh, we have raised all of those questions, and uh, we will continue to raise those questions. Uh, I think it's uh, very important for this department to uh, continue to find ways to avoid situations like this. Uh, uh, this is not something that uh, uh, we want to have happen again. Uh, are connected, conducted and uh, how quarterbacks and other people conduct themselves and sure, uh, that's, that's, we all engage in that and certainly we've engaged in that here. This is a, you know, this is not like a football game. Uh, it's, a, it's a life and death kind of situation. It deserves every bit of our attention and it is getting every bit of our attention. Uh, I've second-guessed them uh, over and over and over, as has everyone who has been connected with this case. Uh, but I, I think in the final analysis, you have to be fair. Uh, you have to strip away the emotion uh, as much as you possibly can. You have to be as rational about it as possible. Otherwise, you cannot come out with, uh, with a fair result. And uh, uh, I think we have come out with a fair result. But I don't believe it has to, that it ends here. I think we have to go forward, and I think we have to find ways to uh, seek solutions. I, I think we have to, it's not just the police department, I think uh, society has to find solutions to some of these problems. You can't, we can't continually try to solve our problems with violence. Violence begets violence, and, and uh, uh, this kind of situation is going to erupt again if we don't find ways to, 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 uh, uh, to solve some of those problems. And uh, you, we, you can put all the, all the adjectives to it, tragic, uh, and all the other kinds of adjectives that go with this and have been put to it, uh, probably still will not describe uh, uh, how unfortunate that it, that it is. Is any disciplinary action going to be taken against the officers? No, the, the action of the officers has been declared in policy, so that would not call for what any kind of disciplinary action. Basically declared by the uh, members of the Board of Police Commissioners. Well, in this particular case, what did it mean? Uh, may defend themselves, uh, and that one officer can defend his uh, his partner. Chief, that that part is pretty explicit in the policy. Chief, do you can take some disciplinary action? Uh, I did not. I, that's not my understanding. I, I know that the police commission wants to, uh, as I want to, uh, review this uh, to see that the department.
uh, people who uh, are expert in the field, and we have sat down with them to find solutions, tactical solutions, to these kinds of problems. Uh, we're going back looking at, uh, at the so supposedly non-lethal weapons again uh, to see if there's any possibility that we could use those. Uh, we have sent our people through training on shooting policy. Every single person this department has gone through. Uh, we're changing some of our shooting uh, tactical uh, uh, programs. Uh, we're, we're, we're going to try and exhaust every means to see that this kind of uh, uh, problem does not occur in the future. Chief, you said one of the questions that perhaps...